Hi and welcome to this session on spreadsheets in science. ICT can enhance teaching and learning in science. Science also provides a context to which students can develop ICT capability and a broader technological literacy. So before we go in and look into some teaching strategies, it's important then that we first look at the ICT tools for classroom teaching that you can use and that I recommend for the development of ICT capability and technological literacy in science, in primary science teaching. So the first one, so what are, what are some ICT tools for classroom teaching for science? of science that you can use to achieve this. Well, the first one is word processes. And yes, they are very widespread. They are generic. And when applying this ICT tool, you'll be in, involved in the explicit skills teaching that, that comes with it. Children need to know what is possible and what isn't. So for example, the use of the shift key can be taught explicitly either informally on a one-to-one -one basis or demonstrated to a whole class. A word processing software can assist with sequencing and sorting information. The degree of preparation and structuring required may vary with the development of the, of the children. Young children may begin by using an on-screen word bank featuring images with text labels to sort materials into hard and soft, for example. Children can also use word processing programs to record investigations as this is a skill that they begin early in their school career. They can also be useful for when seeking information from databases, as they can make their own notes about what they have found and supplementing these with images or text copied and pasted from other electronic sources. So that's one of the most obvious ICT tools that you can use. And there's many ICT techniques and skills associated that can help develop ICT capability. The next one is graphics software. Now these again are also generic, generic and generic graphics programs can encompass painting and drawing software. Children can manipulate and present images while at the same time extend their repertoire of knowledge skills and understanding through structured activities and interventions. In learning in science lessons, children may use this type of tool to produce images which illustrate the effects of light sources, for example. Much science work these days requires illustrations to aid communication. By using graphics software, you are enabling children to create, import, and modify images when required. It also supports the addition of labels to aid identification and explanation in science lessons.